In this class we will present the commands Rev Surf, Edge Surf, Rule Surf and Tab Surf, which allow you to create meshes of greater geometric complexity. Open the available file and see that we have some geometries that we will use throughout the class. We will start with the command Rev Surf, which creates a cylindrical mesh by rotating a profile around an axis. We can select a 2D or 3D line, arc, circle or polyline, to sweep in a circular path around an axis. Let's practice, triggering Rev Surf, selecting the polyline for scanning and clicking on the axis. We press enter to specify the initial angle with zero value. For the final angle, we can enter a value other than 360 degrees. And with positive values the scan will be counterclockwise and negative values clockwise. We press enter setting the 360 degree angle for scanning. See the result, we have a mesh obtained from the revolution of a polyline around an axis. We can refine the mesh by the system variables surf tab 1 and surf tab 2. Surf tab 1 specifies the number of tab lines that are drawn in the direction of the revolution, that is, defines the subdivisions of the mesh. We trigger surf tab 1. Type 50, and hit enter. Surf tab 2 specifies the number of tab lines that are drawn to divide them into ranges of equal sizes. We hit surf tab 2, type 50 and hit enter. Now we repeat the command ref surf. C. We have a smoothing of the mesh, improving the look of the model, but requiring more computer resources for processing. Now let's look at the command edge surf, which creates a mesh between four adjacent edges or curves. We trigger edge surf and click on the objects alternately. See the result, we have the mesh completed and its smoothing is related to the values of surf tab 1 and surf tab 2 that we specified earlier. Next we look at the command rule surf, which creates a mesh representing the surface between two lines or curves. We fire the command, select the first row, select the second row and ready, we have a mesh created between the two selected rows. Next, let's look at the tab surf command, which creates a mesh by sweeping a line or curve along a straight path. We trigger the command and select a line, arc, circle, ellipse or polyline. Next, we select a line or polyline to determine the direction vector, thus defining the length of the polygonal mesh. C we create meshes easily using different features. We saw in this class how to create meshes with the commands Rev Surf, Edge Surf, Rule Surf, and Tab Surf.